Hello, Suzanne from Suzanne Scarrow Live here. How are you today? How was your Christmas? And what are you planning for the new year? I hope that you are committed in this next 12 months to you so that you actually take care of who you are and take your power back. Do you sometimes find that, you know, you please others, you put a lot of energy into pleasing others and then find that you are depleted yourself? Or are you often feeling like people don't understand you, that you're misunderstood and frustrated because no one really seems to get you and understand you? Have you even spent many hours worrying about what others will think of you and perhaps even holding yourself back from being who and what you want to be? because you're so concerned about other people's reactions to you, especially if those people are close to you, if they're perhaps family members or loved ones that you really do care about what they think about you and they might have different ideas for what they want for your life than what you have for what you want for your life. The, the problem is when we put too much importance on what other people think, we often will sabotage our own journey through life. and. That means that you're really you're giving your power away. And what I want to encourage you to do today is take your power back. How do you want your life to turn out? What do you want your next five years and 10 years and 15 and 20 years to look like? What do you see yourself doing in the future? If you had no limitations, if you had no limitations, financial or geographical, what can you imagine your life would be? That's what you want to aim for. I, I hear people say so often, but I don't know who I am. I don't know what I should be doing. As though there's some predestined pathway for them to take and they haven't yet figured out the map. But you're the writer. You're the creator of the map. You can make it whatever you want it to be. You just have to follow your heart, really. When you follow your heart, when you're following the passion, the things that interest you, you are creating the pathway to your life that you desire, that you actually designed before you came. You didn't come here to please other people. You came here for the joy of the journey. So I really want to encourage you in 2020 to seek that pathway that brings you joy because that's where you need to be. Okay, I'll talk to you again soon.